you know, the uh, the video game, but they understand how Monopoly is played, so they yeah. can play. It just means the kids can cheat better than they can is all. Oh, God. Kids can always cheat. Yeah. So do you want to continue, we'll continue about Blu-ray? Yeah. Or do well, you want to talk about the other stuff? No, Blu-ray was on, the Blu-ray was the last one we did in the day. What is the other stuff? Um, walking around the convention. Oh, actually, you kind of did. No, the walking it. around the convention took place before and, yeah, before Blu-ray, but we... You know, I, I mean, I can tell you, I could get in trouble. There okay, was, go on. Talk there about There were so the much god awful, stupid things that I saw. I'm going to tell you that you there's one seen. that is not on the floor, but they were telling me about. Uh, they said it would make Al Bundy very pleased because, oh, we put it this way, uh, you could remotely raise your toilet lid. Yeah, if you know, a guy, you know, his wife was using it, so instead of that reaching... That sounds like it, a prank! No, no, I, I've like actually a, seen the stupid thing. Somebody's going to the bathroom? No, 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 no. He, he had a video of it. They're really serious. But I have seen it on, I've seen it for sale elsewhere. You push the remote control before you go into the bathroom. It raises the toilet lid for you before you get in there. And, you know, you see, you know, that you're your Peggy is that, Bundy. Is that like warming the seat before yeah, you go to the... I know, but you're Peggy that Bundy. Nice. You know Al doesn't necessarily flush the toilet when he leaves. So when she hears he's left, she, by remote control, flushes his toilet for him. Is that uh, fine? Yeah, <laughs> oh, there was more things. Okay, Th this one could also get me. This one, you have to be old enough to remember batteries. Car batteries originally came, they weren't sealed units, they came with little caps on the top. They generally came dry to the, um, to the dealerships and then they, they put water in, like distilled water in them, that activated the battery, which is why batteries lasted forever, because unless you activated it, didn't come, you didn't use it. But they have batteries that help, I want to tell you this, if you add water to the battery, it makes it work. It gotta be different than before. No, it's exactly the same. Are you serious? It's exactly what it is. Is they use they're using okay, the uh, water activates the chemicals that are around you know the the units to make the battery. Like I mean, basically, they got the little plates in there. You pour the water in, the chemicals in there like um, uh, sulfuric acid is in it. Mm -hmm. You pour you pour the water in with the sulfuric acid. It causes a chemical reaction that causes an electrical current to take place. I I I, I asked the guy about that. And he uh, he uh, he. Uh, uh, that's what that was my that's my response. <laughs> yeah, because I'm old enough, you know. That's because he's old enough to remember all that. See, I, see I'm old happened? enough to remember things. Okay, they got these stupid fizz drinks that you can make and shake up. But I would would put it way back in the in the early 1950s. They used to sell that stuff, you know, they put it in a straw, and you could sit there and, and, and make your own, you They know, just brought it back. Water. It's just they, like they fashion. They named it a different name, but they're, they're, this is, this is eco-friendly because you're not using anything dangerous. You're powering your battery with water. Well, yeah. They, they, they did that, you know, the water and sulfuric acid is always a good way with a carbon, carbon, it's, carbon it's, proper They plate. haven't done it in a while, so it's new. Well, I know, because the, okay, there's nobody young, you're eight, you don't remember. But see, I've also worked enough on automobiles. I've also, they used to have a device called a hydrometer, which you put into your, into your battery that could tell, you know, if you needed to put more sulfuric acid or stuff in it. No, but it's why when acid, when the batteries used to blow up, you could hurt somebody really badly because you're throwing acid anywhere. And also, you know, you, you, know you, you pour too much water into your battery when your battery is low, it flushes the sulfuric acid out all over the place. Your eyes are looking tired. Yeah. Should no, so we change down. the light? No, that's all right. But the lights, you know, so we've lost one row of our lights. But uh, no, but, but the, all the Blu-ray stuff basically. Um, um, the, you know, the, uh, basically, there were uh, 10.7 million Blu-ray uh, capable devices shipped uh, since 2006 in the United States. But uh, this is the way it gets tricky. That includes PS3s. Yeah. Which it's is basically is the doing. bulk of the devices that have been shipped. You know, um, basically, uh, they have... Uh, Basically, during the okay, but they're telling me like only 5.4 million DVD players have been shipped during the same time period when DVDs came around. Mm -hmm. The problem is, they didn't have devices like PS3s that played 
DVD. So you're telling a true figure versus another figure. But it's still a true figure. I know, but, but most But it's okay. apples and oranges. Okay. It is okay. not apples and oranges when you understand that a gamer would never commit sacrilege and put a video on his game box. Yeah, but a parent who bought it for him for Christmas for would. <laughs> yeah, but how, how, what do you think is going to happen when a kid fighting your dad? You, you, I want my PS3 back. So, but, um, but they've somebody got... somebody do um, something like that? Yeah, we've got, um, basically, there was a flood of hardware sales in 2008, which they hadn't mm -hmm. expected, and there's now 1,100 ti software titles available, but the problem is in the details again. That's because still a lot. Because you know that the PS3 makes up the bulk. Of the no, cells. no. And, and, At 1100 that's a no. large number. PS3 makes up the bulk of the cells. What is PS3? So it's a video game. And most a of gaming the, console. Most of the games turned out are in high def yeah. and in Blu-ray. So? So the 1100 is misleading. How many of that 1100 are video, uh, movies? How many are games? You're still Blu-ray. I, I know. <laughs> basically, they are. Basically, see, uh, it's still Blu-ray. Okay, we'll, we'll go back to uh, you know, you know, back to uh, Sir Lawrence Olivier and Tony Curtis in Spartacus, you know, because he, he basically Sir Lawrence Olivier was uh, making a, a pitch towards Tony Curtis, and he said, you know, you know, do you, you know, have you have you ever ate uh, um, an oyster? And he said, well, yes. He said, you ever ate a snail? And he said, no. And he said they taste exactly the same. It's just like apples and oranges. So uh, there, there is a, you know, the, 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 if so, so when the you, you're talking about the regular DVD cells at that time, there was not a gaming console that had DVDs on it. So, so what? So no, it so? is because <laughs> if you're trying to if you're trying to make yourself look good, you should give accurate figures. Our, our figures are all so different than what we got uh, um, was it a month or so ago at the uh, Consumer Electronics Association Forum. Oh, you know what? You have to go back and look at that one. Yeah, they're different because they said... <gasps> now we could go back. Okay. Yeah. But, uh, let me see. No, there, there's more than... Um, okay. The, the Blue Knight sold... Basically, the Dark, the Dark Knight. Knight, which we do have, sold uh, one million... Uh, one million copies it has sold. That's phenomenal. <laughs> Not when you compare it to DVDs. How that? much okay, how much how many DVDs how many um, how much volume makes a popular DVD sell? Okay. I have seen uh I, I've seen I've seen a DVD sell at ten million copies. Okay, so anyway this was this the first one to do million. million. Copies, but one that's a big million. deal. But like they said That's why yeah, the, okay. this is a big deal. But then we get into the apples and oranges again. Two million, two point three million title, Blu-ray titles were sold in October. Three million in November, and eight million in December. Well, it's called. I can Christmas. guarantee you that they said that the rise in 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 consumer spending during this time was in gaming, not in DVD. That's okay. DVD sales are down by nine percent. Gaming is up. How See? much of this of this you know? Sales were Blu-ray games and not Blu-ray movies. But there was well, one well, thing very because remember in the gaming figures you're looking at, you're okay. looking at all the games, whether it's Nintendo okay. or Xbox okay. or PS3 but, or PS2. There were no movie executives in the building, but there were gaming people in the building. Okay. Uh, that is my I know. See, I, we've been we've been with the Blu-ray, so we've done Blu-ray since the day it appeared. I That's have nothing true. against Blu-ray. That's true. Remember, we watched it from the first time that Sony was debuting it. Yeah. In fact, we had watched so many Blu-ray presentations that we could look at the connections, and at, at the equipment, and tell what something. it was going to look yeah, like. Because one of the things they did sell, say that one of the reasons that people are paying attention to Blu-ray now, we're going to love this one, is that they have match components. Well, isn't that what they should they have been said, doing in the they first said place? It makes a difference. We told people, okay, the first day we went in, the, 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 the young gentleman that we talked to said that this would look much better. They had a Pioneer cables hooked to a Sony thing. <laughs>